When the president, as he did again yesterday, um, retweets things uh, from people who say you don't need to wear a mask, how unhelpful is that from a medical perspective? Well, you know, I mean, I, I, uh, this issue of tweeting and retweeting is something that I've, I've never understood or gotten involved in, but I can tell you, it, it, you'd have to say it's not helpful um, if, if people get signals about not wearing masks when we're trying to get people to universally wear masks. So you would ask the president not to do that? If he well, you know, that's, uh, but Kathy, that's not the way it works. I think my feeling about what we should do with masks is very, very clearly understood by everyone, including those in the White House. What about hydroxychloroquine? And I ask you about this because it's come back into the news because the president yesterday evening in the White House stood there and said that he believes in it and that it is safe um, and again seem to be touting this drug. Is the president right? Again, Caddy, it, it's, it's not productive or helpful for me to be making judges on right or wrong. But what I can say is what I have said all along, that the overwhelming uh, body of data from trials that were well run, randomized placebo controlled trials, indicate that hydroxychloroquine is not effective in treating coronavirus disease or COVID-19.